What up, uh, YTPC? So, here's a, uh, a special video for you. As you can see, I'm I'm uh, I'm a quite sweaty here. I uh, just got done working on the farm and came back to a package in the mail. It's actually, uh, man, quite a bit of chainsaw on. So, uh, <laughs> I am extra filthy today, but. So, it's kind of a uh, a double, a double pleasure here. How? Oh. Before I get to my tobacco yabo, I've got um, a gift from my wife. So uh, she surprised me with uh, some more tools of the trade. So let me put uh, put my pipe down here and uh, kind of show you. So. She got me this phone tripod that can hold my phone right here. And it's basically, uh, hold on. It's basically going to sit like that and help me out. And then she got me this. This light sticks on to the end of your phone. And you turn it on, I guess like this and it helps illuminate. Remember all them times, those videos, I had to uh, be like, man, I, gotta, I had to get a flashlight shining on me. Well, my wife really hooked me up, and so I, I've got like legit uh, uh, video equipment now. So hopefully a little better uh, camera stuff here coming at you uh, here soon. Anyways, let's let me mount let me mount my camera in here one moment. Oh man. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Ah just dropped everything. There. Alright, so it's in it's in there. Let's see here. There we go. So I don't just like Hey, there we go. And then let's see if we can uh let's see if this light works. All right. Right there. Yeah, that works. I think that kind of, I think that gives a little, a little ambiance. What, what do you, what do y'all think? Yeah. So anyways, oh, and it also came with this, uh, little, little Bluetooth device. It's, it's basically a click on the phone. So I click this, it stops recording. It either stop, starts or stops recording via Bluetooth. So no more of y'all seeing me like reach over and hit the, hit the stop button to uh, to stop the recording, I could just you know from a from a stealthy angle, I guess. Anyways, so now that I got, I'm all set up with my equipment and whatnot. Here, let me let me scoot you over a little bit. Uh, I will show y'all. This is a small yabo from uh, Pipes and Cigars. Um, like I said, you know, it it took literally. Seven days. It took a week for my pipes and cigars order to get here when it took, I think, two, three days for my smoking pipes. You know, my, my just previous Yabo. But uh, but it's here. No worries. And um, I got some goodies. So, so let's start off with one of my, one of my truly favorite tobaccos. I've got some more. Colt Blood Red Moon. So, you know, can never have enough of that. I think this makes um, five tins. And, oh, oh, what is, oh. Six. I now have six tins of Colt Blood Red Moon. So, that will, uh, that ought to last me a good bit. And then, because, you know, uh, Pipes and Cigars are doing a sale on Colt. Um, you buy uh, four tins, you get one, well. You buy three tins, you get the fourth free. So I bought four, but um, these I noticed they had this blend in stock that they've been out of for a while. That is Cult Embassy. So this is supposed to be. I, you know what? If I remember correctly, I don't think Embassy's an aromatic. I think it's uh, just a, a regular, 
uh, non-aero. But I'm definitely going to give it a shot. So, and, oh, here's, uh, so, got two. So I got two Blood Red, Red Moons and two uh, Embassies by Colt. You know, wonderful tobacco company. They've, I've never been disappointed with any of their tobacco. I've, I've tried every, I own every blend they have. Uh, Embassy was the only one I was missing. And um, I still need to open, I have not opened uh, Colt Profile. That's uh, another one of their blends. You know, I got the tin in there. I just haven't haven't opened it. But uh, so there's my Colts, and now let's move on to to a to a blend that is slowly slipping away, but I still got it. Dunhill Dark Flake. Boom, got two. So. Uh, so yeah, so that's that's my order right here. I've got uh, just got a lot of a lot of tins, uh, four Colts, which is two Blood Red Moons, two Embassies, and two Dunhill Dark Flake. And as I mentioned in my previous uh, video, um, this is probably going to be my last Yabo for a while. Again, uh, our finances uh, have changed. So, um, but you know what? I've got plenty of tobacco in my cellar and y'all will be getting a lot of reviews coming up because I plan on uh going through my tobacco buffet and just uh opening it right up so um yeah I guess that's it let me uh where did my my pipe went out I got too excited talking about my tobaccos I forgot about my pipe yeah well Anyways, so I just wanted, you know, to say thank y'all for uh, being a subscriber and, uh, and you know, kind of kind of a glimpse at my uh, semi-homestead. Uh, if y'all are keeping up, this is actually um, at a family member's house. We're staying with them just down the road from our farm while we um, build our house. We haven't quite decided what um type of home we're gonna build but we are leaning heavily towards earth bag so and i'm gonna try to chronicle it um the build process but you know i've watched all these other uh uh people on youtube doing earth bag uh time lapses and stuff like that and uh i don't know might be a little over my head when it comes to video. I've never done video editing before. The best I've ever done is that uh, that trim with that uh, animation. And uh, that was just through an app. And it was kind of like just drag and drop. And the app did it for me. So, we'll see. Oh, and I am smoking uh, the Hunter Blend. Uh, Eric Nording Hunter Blend. So I guess that, that light's a little too bright, isn't it? Man. Yeah, Eric Norting Hunter Blend. So so let me know what y'all think about, you know, my new my new camera equipment, my you know, my light, my stand, and uh let me know if you uh notice any quality difference. And let me know um uh what's what's your favorite aspects of uh of my videos and you know things like that. I'm just you know, I'm trying to put content out that uh, people like, enjoy watching, and uh, you know, hope I'm doing a good job. But uh, anyways, this is uh, Catholic Pipestetter saying God bless and pleasant smokes.